I was set to do my A-levels in the summer of 2020. I was studying physics, maths and economics. Coronavirus came along to ensure that my exams didn't go ahead, but it didn't faze me. This is a short story about my journey towards becoming an Edwards Vacuum degree apprentice. I had applied to many universities through UCAS and I had offers from three strong unis. I was always set on going to university, but I was told by people around me to consider other paths as well. I'm so glad that I did. After applying at Edwards through the Find an Apprenticeship website, I quickly received an offer to an interview. Considering the firm was three and a half hours away from where I was living in the Midlands, I was in two minds whether I wanted to go or not. If nothing came from it, at least I'd got the experience of an assessment centre. The day was excellent. I was blown away by how welcoming and friendly everyone was. I was competing with around 20 other people for a place at Edwards. I made sure to be myself and communicate as much as I could with the other candidates. I had an offer to a second interview at Edwards and I was excited to get going. Once again, I tried my best to demonstrate that I was trustworthy and someone that can communicate efficiently. I also did lots of research into the company. When I was offered the place, I was ecstatic. Now I'm here, I'm working closely on important projects, picking up lots of responsibility and learning so much. Being paid to go to university isn't so bad either. When looking to climb the job ladder, there is so much opportunity for career development and I'm excited for what the future holds for me. If you're in the same boat as I was last year and you think that learning with your hands is the way to go, please consider a degree apprenticeship. I think it's the best way to go and it's often not even considered by many young people. A degree apprenticeship isn't only for engineering either. Wherever you are and whatever you want to do, there's a job out there for you.